माई नेम इज़ अविनाश आउटे आई डी माई बी टेक एम टेक इन आई आई टी बॉम्बे वर्क फॉर डोंकीज इयर्स इन द इंडस्ट्री सिंस टू थाउजेंड सिक्स और सेवन आई एम वर्किंग विद डॉक्टर फाटक ऑन इज एजुकेशन इनिशिएटिव ओके दिस एक शिक्षा आई स्टार्टेड अबाउट थ्री इयर्स बैक इन टू थाउजेंड इलेवन दिस वॉज लॉन्च्ड ओके द कंसेप्ट इज एज यू कैन सी वन नेशन वन ज्ञान मीनिंग आई आई वॉज रियली अपसेट दैट ईच state is coming up with its own books on physics chemistry okay while in my opinion the ncert books are more than enough okay they are literally very very excellent meaning i have worked mostly on uh, cbc ncert books only okay so the concept was um, to have all take a lesson okay take a cbc lesson and bring some life into it that was the concept and the second concept was to take that lesson and translate it into all indian languages all international languages doesn't matter i am technology okay i am not an educator okay but i am a perpetual student so this site is based from the student's point of view what i think the student requires and what i think technology can bring to the student okay how does it relate to mooc okay the way i think it relates to mooc is this site has got a lot of interactive learning things there are about 700 of them okay each one of them was very simple it was very nice that i am doing it immediately after him because there are lot of things said who is the subject matter expert for me the subject matter expert is cbse okay so i don't do go outside it not generally not there are a few things outside where i am sure of the physics of it okay and cbse books are very very amenable to what he terms as simulations and what i term as interactive learning objects okay They're very amenable okay that's why i was able to create 700 of them without having any subject matter expert because the books themselves say what what should be animated what should be the interaction okay so now let's try with uh, let's start with what i have i'll start with physics mechanics Let's pick this lesson. All the CBC text I have converted from PDF into HTML. Okay, this is not a pure HTML. This HTML has been broken down into strings. All the strings have been stored in the database. Okay, when I bring up a lesson, I take each string, join it together, and then give you a lesson. Okay, the reason is I can at a click of a button give the same lesson in Hindi. now hindi i have picked up from the pdf is not complete okay because cbsc has published pdf of hindi i don't have soft copy okay so i have got a person who is actually taking cut and paste and putting it in <laughs> string by string okay because unfortunately the pdf to html converter does not work okay on hindi at least okay so it is a painful exercise so this hindi is correct okay it works will tell you how to do it huh it works you will tell you okay it will solve but that will only work for hindi okay if i convert it to for example any south indian language here nine languages are supported on the net okay now i don't know whether this is correct or not okay <laughs> because all i have done is taken the string given it to google translate whatever i get i put it there okay <laughs> no it is dangerous okay but it is translatable on the net okay so you can actually log in as a translator take it string by string and give me the correct translation on the net it will come on the net okay so basically it can be done by it is based like a wiki all right so let's not go into let's go back to english okay <laughs> what do i have in addition to the book okay in addition to the book i have got about 11000 questions okay of this this variety right so let's try one okay now these questions are not classified currently under i don't know whether they are right or wrong i'm just showing you how it works okay okay i can skip i said done the software will tell me which of my answers are correct or wrong okay i can go for the next set okay and the next set it will repeat okay so basically this is probably all mechanics questions 
these are not strictly related to the chapter ok, because when I got ok, the way I was able to do all the 11,000 is Dr. Fatak runs a summer internship program ok, as a part of that program about 50 percent of the work whoever works with me I ask them to prepare content ok, so I have not looked at the question, but these are engineering students ok, and we are not talking about engineering physics, we are talking about 9 standard physics everybody knows that ok. So, they can create questions and they can put it in all right. So, I can go with the next one and next one and next one. So, the 11,000 not only true and false, but other other types as well. Let me show you different types of questions again this is based on students ok. So, it is not as if it is a exam you have got 4 right you have got 5 wrong you can always retry. Right. Oh my God, this is uh, this is direct that is ok, then I cannot help it, it is supposed to be random. Uh, see now this will say red, but it does not stop me from doing that, I can go and do this wherever it is third law uh. Uh, ok. So, this is the second set I have ok. See the basic purpose is start with the basic assumption that CBSE books are the best and I actually literally believe it over the past 2, 3 years ok. I have literally read all CBSE books including NCRT physics and maths NCIT books sorry NCIT books. So, they are the best right. So, I literally read all of them ok, because I had to create what, what I am coming to is the next set of activities. There is multiple choice and fill in the blanks, fill in the blanks is like this. I gave four options and you can drag and drop ok. Ok, again the same principle I can go for the next one. So, this gives you crossword is not been implemented as yet ok, but for cross ok. Now, again based on the Eka Shiksha philosophy it is an open source thing it is open to the world all right. So, teachers can contribute ok. So, I have got a nice little framework where you can say for this topic this is the fill in the blank I want to add you can give a sentence and you can give these are the options. What is the license you mentioned? Creating from copyright. There is no copyright it is free interactive and downloadable ok. It is downloadable also there is a bag there ok. So, the idea is a 9 standard student can take all 9 standard content. I unfortunately happen to be the web administrator of the NCRT's website hmm. and what you have done is a copyright violation. Uh, yes, I agree ok. You have picked up a copyrighted material and released. No, I will tell you, I will tell you I have, I have wait, 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 wait to answer your question ok. I have looked at your copyright thing it says you are encouraged to use it and distribute it and promote it it says that in your copyright law. Uh, so, I am that is my fallback version of doing that ok. My second fallback version is I am not making any money ok. So, I think I covered the lesson I have shown you how uh, you that you can add questions to it ok. You can add questions to it ok. You can add um, you can translate it ok, huh. plus ok one more thing I will do, go do in the chemistry lesson ok. So, now let us see what I want to cover is for the same lesson I want to show you a three interactive objects which have been created all right. Uh, I do not have a lesson window up ok, but the lesson if you go back to the lesson the CBSE lesson has exactly what I am going to show you. One of the activities of the CBS, CBSA lessons is this ok, okay that is why I am saying I do not need a subject matter expert because the NCRT books are my subject matter expert ok. So, if you go there there will be an activity which says take this put a block on the table push it and see that it moves if you push it from both sides if the this side pushes more and that side there is some content I am sure ok right. So, this activity allows me to do this. 
I can change the left mass. Okay, I can show velocity, show acceleration. See, it has started moving. Okay, and it shows all the values here. Okay, I can now change the right mass and I make it move the other way around. I can pause it, I can note it. Okay, and since you talked about this, okay, if during simulation I change the left mass, okay, now see the force is this side, but the velocity is that side. The student can actually experiment. Okay, with all kinds of things to learn whatever the teacher has taught him. Okay, whatever the teacher has taught him is there in the NCIT books. It says conduct this experiment. Okay. So after that book, this becomes an addition to the book where instead of taking a physical table, putting it there and pushing it and things like that, where you cannot measure. Huh. It's like a virtual. I won't call it a lab. Is the specifications are there in CBSE? I don't want to think. Okay, but I don't know how to teach. Okay, the NCIT books has said this. If you do this, you will learn something. So I'm allowing him to do it. Okay. So this is one which is exact copy of CBSE. Probably it gives more things that necessary because somebody asked. Okay, whether I can turn it off and on. Okay. So basically, you can define how that experiment is to be conducted. Okay, and what should what are the values the student should see and what is the control the student should see. Obviously, that is why I, when I talked to him, I said you will get less color, but you will get more physics. And this is exactly true. Everything has got physical equations at the back, physics equations at the back. Okay. Okay. So, this is one. I want to show you a second simulation, and there are about 700 of them covering all subjects. Okay. The other thing that was there was Galileo's inclined plane experiment. This is also an exact copy of the book. Okay. It says have an inclined plane like this, have an inclined plane like this, drop the ball, observe how far it goes. Same chapter, same thing. Okay. So, what, what it allows me to do? Set height of ball, set angle of second wedge, okay. then I can start simulating. In between, I can change the angle of the second wedge, it will go up like this. Okay. I can bring it down here, this is very interesting. Stroll up like this. Okay. Right. Again, exercise activity given in the CBSE book captured on this. Okay whether anything else can be added to the experiment, whether the student can learn anything more, I do not know. Okay. The way the, all this was done was, when I went to the book, I said activity will learn, draw one wedge, draw one wedge, somebody talked about story. My story board was this, refer to NCRT book, this activity, you need this, you need this and I need the control to change the angle of this thing and change the height of the ball. This wouldn't be controlled automatically, why does the object accelerate when it is coming back from the second thing, is it an illusion because this object is okay? Probably, probably. This watch now. Okay, it is probably not taking care of that rolling and all that business, probably. Okay, I do not know. So, actually, when it starts, it actually No, 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 no. No, uh, no, he is right. There, there seems to be an effect at this point. At this point, it seems to be going faster. Okay. No, 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 no. That, that is okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. And a third one I wanted to show you from this is. Uh, I would like to mention one thing. When you open source these things, there could be a large community, just like this was spotted here. Somebody will spot it. And some programmer in the community will say, all right, let me look at it and make modification. And then you will, you will get this better and better. So, uh, one thing Avinash is what is not clear to some is whether these are also released under Creative Commons CC BY SA license no, or not. They are yet. released uh, as free to use. No, but. I am not releasing open source. I am not releasing source. Why? 
why very good question because the only reason I am not relating source is mm. okay there is a whole set of community over there okay mm. Mm. you can go to merit nation mm. okay they have got a lot of interactive objects right they have got a team of 40 subject matter experts mm. plus I do not know about 100 animators mm. whatever these guys are talked about mm. I am not going to give my ideas free to them. <laughs> That okay. is not in the spirit no. of open source. No, no, that may not be. But my thing, I will not give to allow anyone to make money. According to me, money is being made in education by a lot of unscrupulous people and I am against it. <laughs> <laughs> huh? Yeah, put an NC into it. NC. Non-commercial. Non-commercial. No, that, that, that's okay. So I have no problem. You can give it free to the teachers. Yeah. No, no, so but… The idea but is also to improve upon this. Correct. Hey, yeah, yeah, you, you can always sub submit to this. No, I have no problem. No, no, no. I will hold, hold no, the no, no, But anyway, you, let's talk about that later. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So, this, this particular yeah, yeah. thing, the reason why I brought this up, it is very similar to the earlier one. Huh. Very similar to the earlier one. Huh. Okay. It shows unbalanced forces, but it shows a lot of other things because now he is talking about Newton's second law. Okay. That's why you have got velocity, initial velocity, displacement, time elapsed, final velocity. Okay. This also illustrates a stopwatch. Okay. We have got a, this clumsy looking stopwatch okay, which can be used in experiments uh, like in the sixth standard there is an experiment on pendulum, you say uh, attach a pendulum then rotate it find out how long it takes for 10. Okay. For that I need a stopwatch. Okay. So, you can count it you can start the stopwatch and you can I have got an observation table where the student can write the observation table okay, and then the software will correct whether it is wrong or not because that observation for example, that observation is what is the time period of the pendulum. If it is within plus or minus 5 percent, I said okay. Then that allows him to increase the length of the pendulum. Okay. Now, that is not included in 6 standard because somebody talked about various levels. For the pendulum, that particular thing is not included in the 6 standard pendulum, but there is a 9 standard pendulum where you actually know the pendulum formula, okay. where the same interactive thing, I will allow him to change the length, allow him to change the gravity okay, and then see what is the effect of time on the time. Okay. So, basically for the 6th standard I am hiding all those features, I am just giving him just a stopwatch to measure this thing standard length okay. yeah. because he does not know the formula. So, here I can do this and then it will fall off. That is okay. So, this is the third animation. Okay. So, physics animations are generally have this concept of experimentation, they have a concept of changing some parameters, most of them. Okay. Right. So, that is as far as physics animations go. Okay. Just, just after the power of the net, force on the log must change in that window. <laughs> okay. It should not stop at that point. I know, I know. Earlier things it stopped. Earlier stop. Stop, but the force will change. Ah, okay. That that thing, it should go away. When it's it, actually, in that thing, what you are supposed to do is, okay, I can reset. Okay, what you can do is this. Okay. Okay. Now start simulating. Okay, and then I can change the leftward force, and then it will go like this. Uh, correct. No, you can adjust it so that you will have velocity going like that, more force like that, so it stops and then turns. Basically, it is an experiment you can play up, play around with it. Okay. Maybe I think the what you have to do is this these forces should be less okay. so that the motion is slower. No, when the block leaves the table. I know, I know, these values should change. Yeah. Correct, correct. And one more thing, uh, instead of giving the uh, numerical value, it is good. One way of presenting animation. The problem is how to prepare students for solving a numerical means how to prepare them, how to solve numerical problems in physics. For that, actually, these digits are not required. What is required is another window in which the equations can be shown. How the equations and balancing of force is changing. Why the left force and right force, the difference or the resultant is giving a rightward or leftward acceleration. So, a separate window no, no, in the next write, level can be in which also. equations should be given. Whatever it can be written here also. Like 
free body diagram. Free body diagram. Ah, I know. It can be done on in this area. It can be done in this area. What See, there is a reason why it is not done. It's my, uh, it's my uh, personal feeling and uh, by experience also ki in the area in which students are lacking while solving a problem is not the numerical values. It is the concept of physics which enable them to write correct equation. Then uh, numerical part is easier. That, that is a mathematics actually, not physics, this part. Some of the physics things, see, I have not done a, anything. I have done, just done the specification. I have got them to do it and I have, I have sort of a team which tested it, okay. That, that was the thing. Whatever is not tested is not even included, all right. Um, so, one of the global instructions which I had given was to avoid text, okay. That is why probably they are not there. To avoid text, not on the grounds of this particular thing, but because I actually want sometime in the future all these things to appear in Kannada. So, this school level, okay, they should appear in Kannada. Okay. So, the software is designed in such a manner that I can translate it, but I have not gone around translating it as such. Okay. Because each of these strings that are that is there, okay, I can get it inserted into a database, pick it up from the database and show the Kannada version. That, that was my final idea. That is why I want I avoided two things, I avoided sound. The sound is almost impossible to translate over the net. Or using Google or anything. Okay. Only the one way is while showing the simulation, parallelly the teacher should write on the white. Exactly. 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 You can pause. You can pause in the middle. Okay. That's why the pause is given. Correct. You you need a you need a teacher. It cannot be done on the on your own. Okay. Okay. Now uh, what I will now show you is how chemistry can be done. So let me go to. Maths, okay. I have four concepts in maths. Okay, remember this is uh, my presentation. I had called it mathematics practice. Was the title? Okay. In maths, the Heron's formula is taught by the teacher. Okay. What does the student need to do? Teacher can teach at one speed, but some student may have doubts. Okay. So what I call as a demo. Demo is my virtual teacher. Okay. The, I'll tell you what the four modes are. Okay. This Heron. Let us take here on, hopefully it will come up. Okay. In the first mode, okay, the software generates a triangle between the values of 2 to 20. Okay. Now, I have made sure that the total sum is divisible by 2, okay. so that I do not work with 0.5. There is no point in working with 0.5, correct. Then I draw the triangle, I write the formula for S, A plus B plus C divided by 2. Okay. Then I plug in the three values and I calculate S, correct. Then I write the formula for area, area is equal to square root of S, S minus A, S minus P, S C, correct. Then I plug in the values okay, and calculate the area. Now I can repeat, I will generate one more triangle, I can repeat, I can generate one. So as many times as he wants to see the calculation, see the procedure, he can see it, the student can see it, alright. Okay. Now there are two modes. I can do step by step in which each step will be executed and there will be a stop. He can understand what has been done. Okay. Next step, he can understand what can be done. Okay. The step mode and the auto mode, I can only, all the steps are there. At the end of the screen, I will follow all the steps and do it, depend on which mode he wants to work with. Okay. So, that is the first demo mode. Okay. Some intelligent students would like also to experiment by saying, for example, let me try what happens for a right angle triangle? Okay. I know it is 3, 5, whatever, does it work? Now, I may not have generated that. Okay. So, he can give 3, 4 and 5. That is what I call an interactive mode. Okay. That is, is a solution on demand. First is teacher on demand, where a teacher comes and keeps on showing the problem solution all the time. Okay. Second is solution on demand, where I give the problem to a teacher. Teacher solve 3, 4, 5. Okay. Teacher will solve 3, 4, 5. Okay. So, that is my second mode, interact, what I call it interactive. The third mode is guided, in Heron guided is not that important, I will show you how it works. Okay. The guided mode, I can give you an example of four digit addition. Okay. If there is four digit addition, in the guided mode, I will ask him to enter the units place ka addition, one digit. 
So, he will do that, I will tell him whether it is right or wrong, then I will go and ask him to enter the uh, tens ka carry, okay. then I ask him to enter the tens ka addition, then I ask him to enter the hundreds ka carry, okay. this is what I call as the guided mode, step by step, same thing can be done in multiplication, same thing can be done in division, first I will ask him this uh, division what is the first divisor unit, then write this, then write this, then write this. How do you okay. judge the educational validity of the stepping that you get? Huh. Uh, there is a level at which I do not want to do There is a level at which you know, when I am introducing a concept I would like to do that. At a, another point I do not want to do that because I, I would want the student to work. Okay. So, what, what basically you want to do is you want to solve problems without a carry first no? No, 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 no. I am saying see educationally when you introduce a concept. Huh. You need to go through that more to explain the logic of this entire algorithm that you are using. Huh. Beyond that, I want the student to challenge himself or herself and go through that. But if in a machine mode, what happens is that that stepping once introduced into that always will give stepping. In the sense, there is nothing that I can switch off. No, <laughs> there, challenge level of your there is a test mode. The final mode is a test mode. Okay, right? The final mode is a test mode. Where, for example, in herons, okay, I will specify a triangle because my software generates a triangle. Okay, I'll ask him to give the value of s. Okay, and ask him to give the value of area, for which he can do his pen and paper calculation, and I'll just say whether he's right or wrong. Is that what you're talking about? I'm only saying that this is an optional sort of aid. Uh -huh, this is optional. practice, practice. Isn't it? Uh -huh. I should be able to switch it up, even willingly. Even as a student, I should be able to switch it up. I know uh -huh. how to do this, why should I go through those steps? Then you do not have to do that mode uh, at all. That is exactly what I will do. Huh. You do not have to do. Uh, the, the four modes are separate. Okay. You can choose whichever you want. Basically, if you are just preparing for the exam, okay, all you can do is let me test theron. So, I will just run the test theron, okay, where I can do S and this. Then I do not have to learn. If I make too many mistakes in that, then I can start with the demo mode. Okay, all are independent, they are not, there is no step by step thing, even independently available to you. See physics is all about experimentation, chemistry at least at the till the school level, actually I am not sure whether to call it chemistry or not because there seems to be nothing, no chemical formula, no balancing, no equations, all that starts on 11th and 12th, okay, 9th and 10th chemistry is a little bit less than what I expected. Again we will choose a 9th standard thing. For example, let us have a look at this sublimation. Again, this is the sublimation thing, it is an exact copy of what is there in the NCRT book, okay. same diagram. Okay. Okay. So, here you have these uh, some explanations coming in as what that phenomena happens. Okay. Then material is reducing, all those uh, particles, gaseous particles are coming. Okay. There is no liquid intermediate state okay. and finally, the burner will stop and the particles will get deposited on the walls as the end of the interaction. Okay. So, the chemistry things are like this. This again almost an exact copy of what I was mentioned in the NCRT books. Okay. It says take a beaker, take sugar and take pudding, except that there is a little bit of an explanation here. Okay. Now, there is five of them, now they will slowly disappear. I is showing the 
concentration graph ok. Then we will drop some more. Okay. So, chemistry is like this there are processes there is not too much interaction ok, but as near as possible to the concept. So, that once the student sees it in the book it is written as words same thing is visual ok. So, it will he will never forget that is my, my feeling. Now again these are not large ok, because at the school level you do not need too much complexity ok. Most of the things are very simple and using simple illustrations like this you can always add a lot of value ok. And there are some things in biology ok, biology is uh, like this I means some uh, another type I will show you this is drag and drop ok this this type I can drag and drop things on the correct place ok. So, these type of things where you have simple things you have talked about a figure you have talked about parts of a flower the same diagram that you have put it there put labels and drag and drop the labels. So, that once you do it once then in the future you can always learn. So, teacher solves the problem step by step ok. So, student can work on step by step this is the second step ok 22 right. I can do repeat another problem gets generated and I can do auto. So, the problem will get solved here and then I can look at it. So, this is one mode again for mathematics this mode is teacher on demand whatever the teacher has taught on the screen ok I can go come home and repeat it. The only difference I have made is my iska baad mein solve nahi kar raho ok kyunki ye can problem nahi hai I do not get a clear ye ok ye ye wala mode hai this is the demo mode and again you can repeat as many times as you want ok. The second mode and this will be true for all mathematics ok. The second mode is where I can give values then the my values will be solved by the teacher again this is true for all mathematics procedures. Again no theory explanation theory is given in the book here you come for practice ok. The third mode I have is uh, this ok which is the guided mode. So, a is equal to 3 b is equal to 9 c is equal to 8 s is equal to kitna value ok. Now, here if I give a wrong value ok it will tell me it is wrong it will ask me to calculate the value. Uh, this is the guided where the student is guided what is the next step what is the next step what is the next step. So, these are simple once you do it it is ok ok. So, here if I give the wrong answer he will tell me the correct answer a b is correct answer hai that wo green mein chahiye nahi nahi ye ye hi galat tha na b is bate do hona chahiye barabar hai. Actually ye 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 aisa cut hona chahiye aur idhar b is aana chahiye ha aisa ho jata to theek hai ha ye cut ka aisa line marna chahiye ho jayega okay and finally ye test mode hai where you can do the test area malum nahi mujhe whatever नहीं you can repeat it tells you नहीं नहीं under root में है अच्छा ये भी उधर चाहिए बराबर है बराबर है ये भी उधर चाहिए 
क्योंकि आई एम नॉट आस्किंग हिम टू डू स्क्वायर रूट क्योंकि हाँ हाँ बराबर है नहीं 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 थोड़ी थोड़ी वो सब सब में गलती होगी क्योंकि ये जो है ना वो देखो वो उनका एनिमेशन इंस्ट्रक्शन क्या था बुक और कुछ नहीं है मेरे पास ओके हाँ हाँ क्या सिखाना है वो मालूम नहीं है ओके और ये स्टूडेंट नहीं किया है ना वो स्टूडेंट करेगा जो करेगा वो करेगा इधर ये आता है टोटल कितना बराबर है कितने कितने अटैम्प्ट किए अभी ये रिपीट किए तो ये दो हो जाएंगे ये जीरो आउट ऑफ टू ओके तो द स्टूडेंट एसेस कर सकता है ही कैन एसेस हाउ मेनी ये ट्राइड एंड हाउ मेनी तो द कंसेप्ट ऑफ मैथ्स एनिमेशन में बता रहा हूँ क्या हो सकता है तो मैथ्स में ऐसे फिजिक्स केमिस्ट्री ऐसे एनिमेशन नहीं होंगे ओके जनरली आई की आई विल शो यू वन मैथ्स एन दैट विल वर्क डिविजन वन मैथ्स एनिमेशन कंसेप्ट आई विल शो यू बट इन मैथ्स आई एम नॉट टू श्योर वेयर एनिमेशन विल बी वेरी यूजफुल ओके एक्सेप्ट एट द लोएस्ट लेवल वेयर यू टीच डिविजन सो डिविजन का मैंने एक एनिमेशन किया है तो मैं अभी अब आपको बताऊंगा सी दिस इज डिविजन ट्वेंटी वन बाई थ्री बाय द एडिशन मेथड ओके सो आई कीप एडिंग थ्री 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 एंड हाउ मेनी ब्लॉक्स आर देयर ओके हेल्ड डू ऑटो ओके तो इधर जब ट्वेंटी वन हो जाएगा ओके तो डिविजन हो गया तो भी रिजल्ट सेवन आ गया अगेन आई कैन रिपीट ओके तो डिवीजन के देर टू मेथड्स वन इज दिस एंड द एडिशन मेथड ऑफ लर्निंग व्हाट इज डिवीजन एंड द सेकंड मेथड इज डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन मेथड तो दोनों का वी हैव गॉट एनिमेशन ओके सिंबल यूज आर वेरी वेरी एंबिगुअस एरो कम यू आइदर इज लेस देन नहीं नहीं एरो होना चाहिए ग्रेटर देन टू पूरा एरो होना चाहिए एक्चुअली सर अच्छा अच्छा ऐसा हाँ 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 वो लेस देन ग्रेटर देन हो रहा है हाँ नहीं नहीं वो तो नहीं ऑल ऑल ऑफ दिस विल नीड करेक्शन ओके अभी डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन मेथड विल बी लाइक दिस हाँ करेक्शन तो करवाना ही ना तो जानते नहीं हो आप जो होंगे आपके आसपास घर के हमारे गोली बैंक करके हमारे ये स्टूडेंट लोगों से बनवाया है समर इंटर्न समर इंटर्न आर प्राइमरी हाँ ये ये उनका मैं क्या बोलता था जो आपको जो काम करवाना है ना आपको सीखने के लिए 25 तक का काम इसका का, इसका करो सोसाइटी के लिए ऐसा काम करवाया है जबरदस्ती का राम राम है वो वो उनमें से टेन परसेंट स्टूडेंट विल बी डूइंग इट वेरी एक्टिवली but please understand that we never had an opportunity of having expert school teachers comment on this ah. is the first time so now Correct. now we will be doing that more often now that uh, thanks to dr rajaram we have come together once and i am not going to let you go anywhere so over the next few years ah. we'll ah. no no yeah this was our focus was never schools yeah okay this was something which we wanted to do outside whatever was the focus but anyway i uh, i think we can wind this up no no one last thing i want to show we wanted to come up with a, a scheme where ek shiksha applets will fit into the proposed ninth standard course and where they will fit in okay so maine mere team ko kya bola tha tum you go to the cbse they have given so many hours of lectures per half aisa usko divide karo come with a proposed plan okay तो हमारा मैथमेटिक्स का प्लान ऐसा दिखता है वीक वन में नंबर सिस्टम टू नंबर सिस्टम थ्री नंबर सिस्टम एंड दिस एंड द वे दैट कोर्स विल वर्क इज ओके इन आवर व्यू ओके 
ये हमने एक वीडियो नेट पे उठा के डाला था अगेन दिस इज ओनली अ सैम्पल वी आर नॉट क्रिएटिंग अ कोर्स आवर ऑब्जेक्टिव इज टू टेक वॉट जो इंटरक्टिव है वो जो प्रॉपर जहाँ फिट होता है वहाँ फिट करके रख दो ओके okay. वो ऑब्जेक्टिव था ओके okay. क्योंकि वी आर नॉट क्रिएटिंग कंटेंट ये एक कैसा दिखेगा तो ये यू विल बी प्रिपेयरिंग सम सॉर्ट ऑफ अ वीडियो और समथिंग फॉर वीक वन विच टॉक्स अबाउट रियल नंबर सिस्टम प्लस दे विल बी टेक्स्ट ओके वॉट इज इंटरेस्टिंग इज वी कैन हैव एक्सरसाइज इज लाइक दिस दिस लाइक होमवर्क ओके दीज आर अगेन एन सी आर टी एक्सरसाइजेस आई डोंट नो यू विल से इन करेक्ट आंसर करेक्ट आंसर इज यस फाइंड फाइव रैशनल नंबर्स यू कैन कलेक्ट दैट दीज आर सम एक्सरसाइज द स्टूडेंट कैन डू ओके देन द इ रैशनल नंबर्स ओके फिर उसका एक्सरसाइज आ जाएगा दीज आर अगेन सी बी एस ई एंड हियर इज यू कैन हैव प्रैक्टिस एक्सरसाइज स्लैश क्विजेस वो यू कैन कलेक्ट फ्रॉम एक शिक्षा यू कैन बिल्ड योर ओन वॉट एवर एनिमेशन ओके दिस इज हाउ अ कोर्स वुड लुक लाइक इन माई व्यू सो आई जस्ट वॉन्टेड टू से विल बी सम वीकली दिस थिंग इट विल बिकम ओपन एट वन शॉट क्लोज एट वन शॉट फाइनली वेन यू कवर विद द फुल नाइन्थ स्टैंडर्ड स्पेक्ट्रम नहीं दिस इज दिस इज नॉट एक शिक्षा दिस इज ईडी एक्स हिंदी का टैब आ जाएगा नहीं हिंदी का टैब आ जाएगा नहीं नहीं लिंक नहीं दिया है वो मैंने नाम कोर्स को नाम देना है ना मैं नाम क्या दू कोर्स का नाम है उसका नाम एक शिक्षा है कोर्स का नाम एक शिक्षा ही लेकिन नहीं टू अदर पीपल यू आल्सो डूइंग नाइन स्टैंडर्ड कोर्स ना दिस इज अ रिसेप्ट टैकल उसको वी हैव क्रिएटेड अ रिसेप्ट टैकल वेयर वी कैन टेक आवर इंटरएक्टिव स्टफ एंड पुट इट देयर ओके इवन इफ दे डू दैट इनिशियली दे विल हैव टू डू इट इन सम पर्टिकुलर फॉर्मेट जो कुछ आप एनिमेशन डालोगे वो कहाँ जाना है उसके लिए एक ऐसा ओवरऑल गाइडलाइन बना के फिर उसमें प्लेस करना है इसके लिए ही बनाया okay. तो आपके <coughs> नहीं मेरा कुछ मैटर नहीं है ये EDS है। नहीं 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 है हमारा ही प्लेटफॉर्म है आई टी बॉम्बे एक्स We have created multiple versions. One version, which uh, Professor Avinash Shaudhary's team has created, is being used for blended books, as I mentioned in the morning. The CS one of the students are learning. The second version is the one which all of you are using, which is called the IIT Bombay Test Server. Same thing. Uh, which is, is which is the same. So you can create any number of courses there. And what he has made is a course which is like a. Uh, hold all kind of thing where people can put variety of things there. That's have a ten minute discussion on whether a set of learning objects constitutes a course. No, it doesn't. There is there is some glue which is missing. Uh, no, no, it doesn't. No, no, I understand. I understand. See, they, there will always be the urge to put in objects like this, the one that you have got now in each of the spins that you have got. There is a running sequence there. There is there is a glue there, yeah. which is holding that first activity yeah, with yeah, the yeah, second. Yeah, yeah. that is not getting communicated even in the morning when we were looking at the demo course see we are not referring to a particular example sir we are referring to what edx delivers and what is that overlay that i need to lay over it in order that it function like a course yes. i think we need to discuss that at some yes, point yes. no it is my, definitely required my session on uh, running and offering a course yeah which is different from creating content huh. right so that i will mention the inter uh, the interactive stuff is only an aid it does not replace any other thing it does not interaction will not no, no. give you so knowledge please do not confuse what he is presenting with a course this no, is not, not a course this, this is, is course. merely a receptacle created to keep all those contents that's all so don't confuse this with the basic theme of this workshop this is an additional session primarily to expose all the expert teachers from schools to whatever we have been doing to get a feedback and to indicate how the same open edx platform can be used even to contain these that's all so this is not a course you okay. are very now, right for, for example i can tell you how such a structure can be used by your team okay basically if you create a maths course like this for example this is the outline okay you start plugging in content you have to create videos okay the moment you want to create an animation okay then you can specify 
कि वीक वन में फॉर दिस पर्टिकुलर सेक्शन फॉर एग्जाम्पल वीक वन का ये जो है इसमें इसका तुम यू क्रिएट फॉर द नंबर लाइन यू क्रिएट एन एनिमेशन लाइक दिस ओके सो द एनिमेशन क्रिएटर के विल नाउ नो कहाँ टेक्स्ट है कहाँ एनिमेशन है कहाँ फिट करना है दिस इज अ जस्ट अ मैकेनिज्म फॉर यू टू स्पेसिफाई वॉट एडिशनल स्टफ यू रिक्वायर अदर देन द कंटेंट कंटेंट इज द सोल के वो जो तुम्हारा वीडियो लेक्चर्स है एंड एनी अदर थिंग इज द सोल अदर सर एडिशनल थिंग्स विच हेल्प एंड ऑल्सो देर इज देर इज अ नोशन ऑफ सिक्वेंसिंग एंड एक्टिविटीज एंड इंटरक्शन विच इज डिफरेंट विच इज नॉट विच इज नॉट सीन हियर अभी आई जस्ट ब्रोकन इट इन टू लेसन नथिंग एल्स लेसन को ब्रेक करके डाला है So, it is not as simple as this anyway uh, teacher is very so can we go over to the next sure. session thank you thank you so much let's give him a big hand for all yeah. the effort thank you